It can be quite a controversial topic among Cameron Parish residents and environmentalists, expansion of liquefied natural gas plants. Though we've heard from both sides of the argument over the years, no one showed up for a public meeting held in Cameron Parish by the Federal Energy Regulatory Commission this evening. Jade Morrow explains why they're here and why they want to hear from the public. Environmental officials were in Cameron Parish to hear from the public regarding the Sabine Pass liquefaction Stage 5 expansion project. Most know this company by its parent company's name, Chenier Energy Partners. They've announced their intent to expand existing facilities and construct a new natural gas pipeline. We as staff will take those comments with us. Um, they will be part of the, the process, the environmental review process that we're conducting. And ultimately, those will, um, will address those in an environmental document that we produce. Basically, this review will be one of the factors associated with whether or not this expansion is of public interest. As a requirement by the National Environmental Policy Act, the Commission will take into consideration the impact of these facilities on their surrounding environment. We'll be looking at a lot of different resources. Uh, what, are, what impacts would occur to water resources, um, biological resources such as wildlife, vegetation. Uh, we'll also look at cultural resources, if there's historic resources in the area. Um, air quality. The project is currently in what's called the pre-filing process and begins before an application is filed. It allows any concerns to be addressed early. During this developmental process before an application is filed, the company can do it and the stakeholders can, can really identify those concerns early in the process. In Johnson Bayou, Jade Morrow, 7 News. If you missed tonight's meeting, there will be another one held tomorrow night in Port Arthur, Texas. We'll have more information on how to get involved on our website, kplctv.com. Cameron Parish 